Hello, welcome back. Yeah, we have experienced uh, a little bit Python, right? After you install the Python environment um, and uh, try on some different ways to the Python environment, interactive mode, uh, maybe editing mode, okay? So basically we have uh, understand just a little bit of the what's a programming uh, language and how to use that. Uh, different uh, computer tools to help us to learn this language, right? So there are a lot of things that we can learn, okay? Uh, in the computer science, the goal of this course, of course, uh, uh, we cover the syntax uh, of the Python, okay? That's an essential part, but uh, uh, to support you to become a uh, better uh, data science, the computer science, or whatever. Uh, actually, a lot of people use the Python to develop the AI applications. But don't forget that there are other programming language like uh, JavaScript, C programming language, some uh, uh, for web application, some for the uh, uh, machine, uh, more lower level, close to machine uh, applications that they want, if they want uh, uh, even faster uh, computer speed. Okay, so uh, I think that the goal of this course is to support you to understand better uh, how computer works. And so we'll be introducing the binary system. Uh, it's essentially uh, the computer deal with the data in a binary form. Okay. Uh, from that, uh, of course, we uh, introduce a different uh, media type. Okay. A data type uh, from the uh, text, uh, uh, image, video, audio, etc. Okay and the hardware, software, and the different level of the coding uh, programming, okay? And how computer, uh, no, how we develop a computer, that's a programming environment, okay? We have an a interpreter, uh, this is a Python uh, uh, environment, and but some programming language, they rely on the compiler, okay? So what's that? And the flow in the uh, in the Python uh, in any actually any other programming languages that you added you run the code you doing the debug okay and uh, when we learn a programming language we actually learn it's a syntax but we solve the problem by uh, putting our statement uh, in a logical way uh, to deal with the problem. To solve the problem, so we may have uh, uh, involved some of the data structures, uh, uh, incorporate with the uh, algorithms uh, to make the make our code uh, efficiently working on the problem. So, what's a data structure in the Python? Uh, actually, they have some building uh, very nice data structure. They have a, a, a list. Python have a list. Uh, have a uh, tuple uh, and uh, Python have a, a dictionary. I ever uh, put the dictionary uh, here. Okay, <coughs> those are very efficient uh, building data structure uh, for the different purpose. Okay, so we'll be talking talking about that later. Um, um, Python also can do uh, some interesting web applications. So we'll be covering some internet applications, some web applications. Uh, by this chance, we uh, talk about uh, uh, how internet works. Okay, uh, you may hear me introduce a TCP/IP, uh, maybe DNS. Uh, but fo main focus will be the web. Web that the main protocol will be uh, HTTP. Uh, so web, how web uh, server, web uh, browser communicate with each other, uh, and it's a secure uh, mode. Uh, here is the HTML. Um, yeah, if you have a 
uh, ever created some kind of web page. Uh, this is a, a hypertext markup language, okay, a kind of web document uh, to uh, encompass the content and the style uh, in the same uh, text uh, information. Okay, it's a uh, HTML. We'll be talking about that. Okay, and some other web programming can also be done with the Python. Okay, so that's it. Uh, so uh, in this uh, course, uh, we'll be uh, covering uh, uh, those uh, module. Uh, um, Beyond uh, the chapter one, besides the chapter one, uh, we chapter two will focus on the uh, the general uh, general building block of the programming, uh, like uh, how come how to learn programming, the uh, data type, variables, uh, statements, uh, how do you create a statement, and the command, write a command kind of for the debugging or for clarify your code and the general programming flow, uh, the linear flow and the branching and uh, the conditional, uh, if condition and the boolean, well, what is a boolean uh, logic, okay? Uh, by doing so, we can do the branch or even uh, create some repeating some uh, routine uh, uh, looping things, okay? And one of the very important feature for uh, in the programming language is uh, we create the module, all right? Uh, we want to uh, reuse something has been well written, uh, reliable, we call the uh, functions. Uh, here I put a software IC, a fancy name on it. It's a Basically, uh, if you have the IC, uh, you just use it, right? Okay, so that the function is uh, function like the uh, software IC. And some advanced uh, modern programming language have the object oriented. Uh, Python is a very object oriented, okay? And uh, we already will be using that, okay? So, uh, another chapter will be uh, focused more on the data. Uh, of course, uh, start with the code. Code is a kind of data, but, but uh, when we uh, when we put our code uh, for running, uh, we need to convert the code into the machine code. Uh, it's a kind of not a binary data. So we must understand the binary number system and the hexadecimal number systems. Uh, it's a uh, sixteen. Uh, base number system, okay. Different type of the text data, ASCII, uh, Unicode, etc. Okay. So from there, uh, we started to kind of mix the programming language uh, syntax uh, by uh, study the study the um, okay. Ooh, by study the. Um, let me make this uh, visible, okay? By study the syntax, uh, the same time we explore the computer system, okay? Let me put it here, okay, nice. Okay, so, yeah, the data type, string data type, method, uh, string method, other, uh, that's a uh, chapter module three so far. I am going to approach it. And from chapter four, there will be the ma multimedia data uh, by talking about uh, input output. Um, normally, input uh, is a file, uh, file input, or can also be the keyboard input. The output could be the file output can also be the screen uh, output, okay? So how to create a file in Python and uh, by importing some library, you can deal with some uh, multimedia data, okay? And why multimedia data uh, takes a huge of, uh, uh, disk size, right? So we need to compress it, 
uh, for uh, storage efficiency or maybe transmitting uh, through the network if, uh, effectively. Okay. So let's uh, let uh, the data perspective of the program and uh, the computer system. Uh, and uh, the next module will be uh, some other essential things of the Python, uh, the syntax part, the conditional, if condition, Boolean logic, and the, and the Python blocks, okay, and the indentation, okay. If you uh, know, have, have learned a little bit other programming language, we know that the programming language, uh, they will create kind of block, right? Uh, maybe use a uh, parenthesis, or the curly bracket, uh, uh, right curly bracket to kind of uh, uh, define the boundary of the block. But in the Python, uh, they do it a little bit differently. They use the indent. Uh, indent is what we uh, hit the tab, uh, tab key. Uh, it looks like uh, this uh, on your keyboard. Uh, and uh, your cursor will will kind of uh, uh, locate it to the certain position. Uh, it looks like uh, you have uh, several space uh, in front of it. Okay, so that's a <coughs> that's an indent, right? You have a different indent. Visually, uh, you will create a uh, new block. This is quite unique in the Python. Okay, and uh, error handling, uh, we call it exception handling. Um, um, you know, sometimes uh, uh, you cannot control everything, but uh, if your program finds something wrong, you want to cap capture the errors uh, so that you still can, uh, can recover or to quit the program. Uh, gracefully, uh, you don't want to kick it out without without uh, uh, preparations. So that's an exceptional handling. Okay, um, um, the looping uh, we call it iteration, a uh, for loop, while loop, uh, quite common in any programming languages. And the function, how to define a function, how to uh, call a fun the function defined. Uh, uh, using the building function or use uh, uh, self-definition functions. Okay, the concept of global local variables are quite important, uh, and um, some uh, data structure in Python building data structure, including list tuple set dictionaries. Okay, and those are the very very useful uh, data structure in the build building Python. And the rest part of this uh, course, I uh, was talking about the uh, high level applications, especially uh, web applications. So, we begin with the how internet works, HTML, web programming, simple syntax, and uh, we'll be uh, write some HTTP uh, application, uh, web application through Python. Okay. So, let the uh, that's uh, our basic uh, uh, learn Python, learn computer science through coding uh, using Python. Okay, I'll see you in the class. Okay, bye bye. <laughs>